The Royal Academy of Engineering has much to celebrate this year. We've played an increasingly important role in harnessing the power of engineering to build a more sustainable society and an inclusive economy that works for everyone. We've engaged with engineers and with the public about these challenges, hosting wide-ranging discussions and talks with experts including fellows and Nobel Prize winners, reaching new audiences with our Innovation Late and online events and listening to, organising events around the country to hear people's views about AI and gathering stakeholders around the world as part of our Engineering X collaboration to support equitable decarbonisation. We funded and mentored engineers carrying out cutting-edge research that will support progress towards a more sustainable and inclusive world. And our entrepreneurship programmes have helped turn innovations into successful businesses with our Enterprise Hub opening new hubs in Scotland and Wales and being named one of the top 10 European startup hubs by the Financial Times. And our Global Leaders in Innovation Fellowships programme is celebrating its 10th anniversary. We're also proud to be launching Green Future Fellowships, a major new programme supporting researchers and innovators to develop and scale up breakthrough climate solutions. Underpinning all our work is a commitment to skills, which is why we launched our Engineers 2030 campaign this year, to ensure engineers have the right skills to meet the challenges of tomorrow. Our This Is Engineering campaign continues to encourage young people to join the profession. And our Graduate Engineering Engagement Programme, growing portfolio of bursaries and access mentoring schemes help people from underrepresented backgrounds to progress too. From how to invest in quantum technologies, to improving the treatment of wastewater, to decarbonising our electricity grid, our policy work has shaped the conversation this year. Working in partnership with other organisations across the professions and drawing on the expertise of our fellows and awardees, our National Engineering Policy Centre has never been more influential with decision makers. This year we were honoured to welcome His Majesty the King as our new patron and with the support of our Royal Fellows we have celebrated the very best of engineering. The 2024 Queen Elizabeth Prize for Engineering was awarded to the pioneers of wind turbines our 10th Africa Prize to the creator of an AI agriculture tool helping farmers slash their crop losses, and the McRobert Award to the Google DeepMind team for their weather forecasting technology. It's been a privilege to work on all of this with our fellows, friends and partners this year, and I'm excited about the future too. With our exceptional community straddling every field of engineering and technology, I'm looking forward to seeing what we can achieve together.